it doesn't look looks plain. All right, so I already have my vinyl cut out right here. So what I'm gonna do is just, I'm gonna stick it on there. So when I cut it, I cut it a little bit bigger than you need it to. So I'll have to fix it. But the most important thing is right here in the bottom, I think. You want to get this right now. So you won't see no chrome because it sometimes looks funny when you have a chrome right here. Gotta overlap it and then you can just shove it in, actually shove it inside. So right now it has a protective film on top. So I'm gonna take that off after. But just make sure everything's being covered and then you actually have to cut it out with a blade. So that's that's just one step. I'm gonna put, put the visors now. I'll fix this after. This is giving you an idea how to do it. So on the other side, I actually did it different. So you won't have a problem and have more work to do you would you have to get this line pretty straight so that way you don't have to mess with it anymore let's get it like right there right straight right there and then that's that's where you're gonna begin I know you've been waiting for this. You probably fast forward to this part just to see how they look. Oh, so this is the OEM Hondas. This is what they look like. They come painted, you can order them, whatever color you want. Airworks.com. You told me they have a one year warranty on the paint. So that's a good thing. So since I already have the tap right here, I'm just gonna leave it like that, leave it on there, and it should be lined up perfect. But um, I'm gonna show you how to put the tabs in if you don't know how to do the tabs real quick. So you can actually slide these when the window's down. So don't worry about that, just put them in there and line up. The most important thing is to line up this correctly and um, stick it on properly. Okay, so here on these things, all you have to do is just, you get this and then you stick it in here. So stick it in here like this. What I did the last time, I actually pulled this down a little bit. You get this. Yeah, and then put it like that and just put it back up. So what, what it does actually holds itself with the, with the window when it's up so they wouldn't be able to take them off. So 
so you could actually move these where you want them so just more or less put them where you need them i've seen people put tape right here marking them in this and that but all you have to do is get this and put it more or less where they're gonna go and then uh just put it in there and then you can actually slide it from the inside if you want so it's not very hard so the rear right honda it's a oem so I'm gonna start from this side and I'm gonna work my way down. like that and then you're gonna get the little pins and put them through the These little pins you're gonna push this one through there and then to the back you're gonna get this one and just clip it on okay so I made a mistake these clips from the HIC ones are actually different they have the whole bigger and the pin is different so I i'm gonna have to replace these all you have to do is just take them off like put, pull this down see how this was going like this direction is like this you're gonna get the other one the same thing with this flat thing up so you just pick this up and uh, stick it in there No, I guess it's, or you just get it from here and then you stick it in there like that. Actually, hold on like that. Yeah, so. Just pick, pull this a little bit down. Oh, I did my other one was easier, I think. I'm gonna show you the way that I did the other ones. This is the way that you're supposed to do it, but I'm gonna show you the way I do I'm gonna do it. You wanna be real careful because if you don't cover the front, it's gonna look funny. So you have to make sure it's perfect on both sides. So you can be right covering the chrome completely. So it looks pretty good right there. So after you put the tape on, then all you have to do is get the little pins and then uh, so the little pin when it pushes in and locks so you if you want to unlock it you have to actually pull this out the other one had another like a washer on the back like a plastic washer but this one's different so this one all you have to do is push it through and that's it